How's it going, guys? Hi, guys. Oh, wow, there are a lot of people here tonight. Everybody starting their semester off good. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, not, not very convincing, guys. <laughs> not at all. Because it sucks. Well, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> this is my first show back from England. Uh, I was away for six months, and I lived in Brighton, and I got to experience, experience the English life. Um, my English accent isn't that good, but I'm, I'm going to torture you anyways with it. So, yeah, you get, you're going to have to sit there and take it. So, welcome. <laughs> All right, um, we are Ad Liberation, and we're going to get started for you. So, Ad Liberation members, come on down! Naive countdown. Uh, Katie and Tim, can you please go in the hallway? Go now. It's right. Wait, oh, it closes. Slowly. Slowly. Yeah. Okay. I need a suggestion of an activity you do during the summer. Fishing. Fishing. Okay, we got fishing. <laughs> so what Sammy and Matt are gonna do, they're gonna do a scene. It's gonna be a minute long. It's gonna be about fishing. And then we're gonna have them do the same scene shorter and shorter and shorter each time. So. <laughs> All right. I just gotta get ready. Oh, I got a big one! I got a big one on the line! I can't! Dad. Ah! Dad. It's never the time for that! <laughs> I gotta reel on this big one! What? Last time you had to get another beer, and then the time before that, Mom was in labor. But this so. is really serious! I've got a big fish, this is more important than your mother in labor! More important than our love? Yes! This fish is enormous! Oh, I think Much it's, bigger than your heart. I think it's got me! It's pulling me into the water! Son, help me! Now that we got it, can we talk? No, we lost the fish! What is wrong with you? So many things, apparently! <laughs> why, don't you why don't you like fishing? I love fishing. Well, then and you, Dad. Scene. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do the same scene. 30 seconds, go. It's a big one! Son, help me! Dad, I help love me. you. Oh, it's never the time. Big you got fish. mom and labor, and you had to get a beer. Come fish on. more important than you. I know. Uh, I'm a disappointment. Help me. It's got me. It's pulling. It's pulling me into the water. Help. Help. Son, why don't you like fishing? I love fishing, and I love you, Dad. We lost the fish. If you loved me, why did we lose the fish? What is wrong with you? See. <laughs> All right, 15 seconds. Go. Dad, I love you. Son, I got More a than fish that on fish. <laughs> Even huge. though mom was pregnant. It's enormous. I'm not for it right now. You have to help me. Help it. There. Now do you love me? Yes. Wow. <laughs> hey, guys. You can come on back. Hey. So we're going to do this scene in seven seconds. And then you guys have to rec recreate it. Awesome. All right. Sounds good. You can do it. Go. Sam, I love you. Mother, mom is pregnant. Here's the Your first. Do you love me? Whoa, oh, I love you so much. <laughs> See? <laughs> you guys got that? Yeah. All right. You've got a minute. All right. Go. I want to go fishing. Dad, you never let me play Mario Kart all day. <laughs> I want to play Mario Kart all day. Well, we can play some form of. Mario fishing, but with real fishing rods. And no, that's the worst kind of fishing. You haven't even tried it yet. 
I've seen it on TV. Son, I'm taking away the video games until you go fishing You with told me. me I can video game fish. I want a video game fish. We can video game fish after we do real fishing. I want to video game fish before real fishing. I want to go real fishing before we go video game fishing. I, I want to go to mom's. <laughs> you know mom's has a fishing pond. I want to stay here. <laughs> I don't know what I want. I know you don't know what you want. I know what you want. What do I want? You want... A fish sandwich! Yeah, I do want that. I want a fish sandwich. Alright, I've got one right here. Sit down. Okay. If you beat me at Mario Kart, I'll eat that. Will you still love me? No. <laughs> Maybe. I love mom. Same. <laughs> so yeah, that was totally the same thing. Yeah, you guys. Good job. Alright, next we're gonna do a tool chest. So this is scene after scene, hopefully connecting into a long story. That's heartwarming and funny, and oh, I hope so. So, can I have Matt up here, please? All right, I am going to build a character for Matt. I need a name for Matt. Thomas. Uh, Thomas. 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 Okay. What occupation does Thomas have? Farmer. Proctologist. 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 All right. All right. All right. All right. Proctologist. Hairdresser. I heard hairdresser. Okay. And can I get an adjective? Crazy. Sexy. Entertained. Entertained. So you were Thomas the entertained hairdresser. You got that? I got it. All right. Take a seat. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. No, I don't know what. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Not too tight. I'm sorry. Is it too tight? Oh no, it's it's wonderful. It's perfect, like like your hair. Thank you. Now I don't know what I want yet for hair. Well, let me show you As what, what styles we have. Oh. oh, thank you. This one looks nice. You're right, it's, it's too curly. Who am I, right? <laughs> this, one looks, this one looks nice. With the pomp, pompadour? Yes, I'll take that one. So, how was your work? Oh, I don't have a job. Oh, really? No, I don't. So how do you plan on paying for this? Oh, I have money. <laughs> I use my parents' credit card. How nice. So they can buy you these nice things. You know, we'll see if it's nice. <laughs> Sir, you need to make them feel good, but you need to tell them what they want. They don't have freedom. You tell them. I tried. I tried. This man came in. You failed. I'm sorry I disappointed you. You are... You are a disgrace. A disgrace. I just want to make you proud. I just want to be like you. Thomas, you can never be like me. Do you think, do you think these golden scissors were earned by a mere mortal? Ouch. <laughs> I present to you the golden scissors. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Use them wisely and fairly. I to wanted. all people in the land! <laughs> I shall hold them. Good. <laughs> Never pass them to a mere mortal, my love. You are special. Yes, my love. I must flutter away now. <laughs> Nice. 
That one looks nice too. I'll have five of each. Ooh, what are those? I'll have one of those. I don't know. Can I have everything? Go back. Well, this was supposed to be for emergencies only. You're gonna break the table. Come here. <laughs> I'm really sorry. He he probably he probably got his rash imagination from me. Yeah. I don't know. What he definitely did get from me. Yeah, why 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 did you marry me again? Show me that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have much of an imagination. It's probably as good as it's gonna get, so those let's are, do it. Those are some <laughs> romantic vows. <laughs> I pronounce you man and wife. Ooh. <laughs> yeah? All right. Go back. I knew that our son would inherit the love of all things, all things sparkly and, and lovely and wonderful. Yeah, sometimes I wonder if he's even my son, because he doesn't have any qualities what? that I have. Hey, Dad, how's it going? Makes you hey, Susan. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna level with you. Do you do you know why I stand on a table and act like a fairy? No, I don't. <laughs> well, you see, the thing is, is. <laughs> I have a problem. <laughs> and I don't know what to do. I just love furniture. <laughs> I just love cupcakes so much. <laughs> you know, we, we we have cupcakes. You don't need to stand on the table. Damn, but it's cupcakes. so much more fun to eat them when I'm standing on the table. Doc, I got these golden scissors in my chest. <laughs> yeah. It really You're hurts. Bleeding a lot. I know. Oh my, my mentors, God. it's tough love. All right. Show me that. Oh, you disappoint me. Ow. You could have the scissors. Reverse. <laughs> disappoint me. Forward. You disappoint me. Ouch. You could have the scissors. You could have the scissors. You disappoint me. Forward. You disappoint me. Ouch! <laughs> I hear you're the best scissor remover in this fair city. Yes, I have removed uh, one pair of scissors. <laughs> New choice. I have removed no pairs of scissors. New choice. I have removed 50 million pairs of scissors. Wow. <laughs> A lot of people get stabbed in the chest with scissors around here. By their mentors? <laughs> I don't know, they come to me with the scissors, not most of them give me the story. Uh, so how many of them live? Uh, you don't want to ask that question. <laughs> I retract that question. Yeah, most of the time we spend all this time talking about how I'm the best, and then by the time we actually get to it, they've lost a lot Bleed of blood, out. you know, it's not really a good situation. Kind of like what we're doing now. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, I've got deja vu. i got two of you. Yeah. Oh, right. So I was in here the other day, and while I don't want to complain, my hair's a little less poofy than the one in the picture, and I think it might have- Sit down! <laughs> Thank you. You're not allowed to complain. Thank you. <laughs> Did you choose this one? If I say no, are you going to push me again? <laughs> Maybe. No. Thank you. I chose that one. I fixed this. Uh, thank you. I fixed this. Thank you. Where are my golden sisters? Scissors, scissors, scissors. The golden what? He's mine. I'll oh, oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's sanitary. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, thank you. How's work? I don't have a job. <laughs> I don't have a job. No need to cry. Please, Fuck up. Please. Fuck up. What are you saying to me? <laughs> ah. Oh, that doesn't look good at all. Get out. I'm sorry. You don't deserve me. <laughs> Doesn't look good. All right, I just good. forgot my credit card. Get out! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
He didn't seem happy. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't. Maybe I've gone wrong. Maybe. <laughs> I think I've got a band-aid. That'll do it. <laughs> Man. Yes, my son! Can you see the top of my head from up there? Oh, yes, of course! Oh, you've got a lovely little bald spot! <laughs> you say it's lovely now, but you should have seen it 15 minutes ago when it was new. Oh, What if... We could just put a cupcake right there on your... We could just put a pancake right there! New choice! We could just put a Cinnabon right there! Dad, your food-based medicine is getting tiresome. Perfect! <laughs> and Susan yelled at me about the Cinnabon expenses. I think she thinks that it was me. I mean, some of it was me. I do like Cinnabon, but a lot of it was me picking up medical supplies for you, and I don't understand why... Yes, I know! I'm... Thank you, my son, for picking up all of these Cinnabons for me. <laughs> They're quite lovely. And I know, I, I ate a little bit of each one. Good! I didn't know if that would... I thought maybe, I didn't know, maybe, <laughs> it seemed unsanitary, but then so does the idea of putting a Cinnabon on an open wound. <laughs> well, it's, it's sprinkled magic. Yeah, I have to tell you something. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I think I was harassed today. <laughs> oh, well, you know my cure for harassment. Just, just throw cupcakes at their faces. Well, I didn't have any cupcakes. I just had Susan's credit card. Show me that. Get out! Get out! You are disgraced! No, get out! And I don't even have that anymore. Because I dropped it and the scary lady in the hair cut place wouldn't let me... Uh. This, is, this is really bad. All right, so now I see $137 at Edible Arrangements. <laughs> yes! That's, $30 that's at... The cure, that's the new cure for harassment! CBS. You send them an Edible and Arrangement? Then, there's a lot of hair supplies, stores. <laughs> well, what? see, what you don't know is that our son has a bald spot. And only I Is can he see. our son? <laughs> yes! <laughs> I promise! <laughs> I don't remember carrying him. Show me that. Hey, Dad. Hi, I'm Charlie. Nice to meet you. This is our new son, Charlie. Goodbye, Charlie. I don't like Charlie. I want to change his name to John. Goodbye, Bye. John. Hi, I'm John. I'm your new son. Hey. hey nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you. Goodbye, John. Go back. So. Yeah, I just met him one day. <laughs> he was our son. I brought him here through the power of confection. Oh, God. <laughs> I have a problem, and the scissor doctor wouldn't help me, and I just have a Band-Aid, but I heard you have some food-based cures. Of course I do! <laughs> I have a whole case of them! So what would you do about... Three puncture wounds. <laughs> I would probably need 20 tons of flour and 30 pounds of sugar and a country full of sprinkles and probably some hydrogen peroxide. <laughs> Far be it from me to question your methods. Yeah, I don't think Susan's credit card can cover all this. <laughs> and but I that, don't know if you forgot, but I don't have a job. That poor boy has three puncture wounds. No, Susan's a, a woman. She's my mother. <laughs> You're right, John. Thomas. Who are you? son. John. I just... Charlie was your son before me. <laughs> you told me to kill him when I... I'm just so hopped up on sugar, I just can't think of it. <laughs> I'm just so confused with my life right now. An Oscar-winning moment. Really weird place in school, and I'm pretty sure 
<laughs> I'm pretty sure I was molested or something at the haircut place because I've skinned where I didn't have skin before, and I think that's what the definition of molesting is. And, and Dad, I just want you to pay attention to me. And I don't get any love from Susan. I don't know what you're doing right now, but I'm really sad about it. Here's a cookie. <laughs> now go! Be free! Will you be my new boyfriend? See? <laughs> <laughs> All right! Good job, guys! Let's see, tell the story. <laughs> All right, now we're going to... Is for me? Need a play. What? I cried. All right, we're going to play a game now, but we need an audience volunteer. Come on, guys. Don't Okay, Purdue, Jack. Purdue, yeah. All right. And then everyone's like, "What's your name?" I'm Cole. I'm Cole. Okay. Michael. No, no, I'm Cole. Not Michael. Nicole. No one's Michael. I'm Cole. Well, okay. So we're going to play a little game of historical ballet. And it's going to be through interpretive dance. So, can I get a historical event so that we can recreate? Gettysburg Address. What was that back there? Waterloo. Okay, Battle of Waterloo. Yes. The Napoleon version or the American Revolution version? Uh, French or American? French. French. Okay. So. Matt is, Matt is, <laughs> what historical figure is Matt in the Battle of Waterloo? Lincoln. Brown. Lincoln. All right. This is the French version, guys. Baguette. Okay. <laughs> Matt is the baguette. That's French we're fighting over. Okay, I don't know history. <laughs> Katie is the what location? Waterloo. Near the Waterloo. <laughs> the Waterloo. All right. Waterloo. All right. And uh, what historical character is Sammy? Napoleon. Okay, she's Napoleon. Let me go grab it. Tia. And Cole. Michael. Michael Cole. Michael. I'm just gonna leave him out. How's Michael doing? Michael's out. <laughs> <laughs> Not Michael. Okay, and I don't know what else we need. Historical battles. He says it was cold, but I don't believe it. <laughs> Look like a Michael. Okay, man. what else uh, is Tim? He's a cannon. He's what? A cannon. Okay. Oh. Tim is the cannon. I should probably tell Tim what we're doing. I'm Napoleon. <laughs> I'm Napoleon. Okay, so we're doing the Battle of Waterloo, the French one. Huh. Matt, what are you? A baguette. Katie. <laughs> the Waterloo. <laughs> Sammy. I'm Napoleon. Tim. I'm a cannon. All right. <laughs> There's no way to get this. Get Michael back in here. Okay, Cole. Michael. Cole, Michael. 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 Welcome back. All right. Have a seat. Oh, thanks. What you doing? Witness is um, this little interpretive dance that we made just for you, and it's representing a historical event, and we're going to try and portray this historical event to you. And what? Okay. Well, I told Michael. Woo! All right. Okay. Well, Begin. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so cool. What a historical 
Oh, I do think that would nice. Uh, <laughs> some kind of battle? Oh. 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 Okay, so, um, what nationality? Uh, I'm gonna say French. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know my history, so. <laughs> All right. This is uh, Battle of Waterloo. All right, yeah. 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 Yes. What was Tim? Napoleon. Can you uh, recreate it for us? <laughs> <laughs> yes! Oh, yeah. Katie! What was Katie? A boat? Close, close. Uh, <laughs> something that boats go on. The ocean? Rain? Well, Too specific. Water cycle? What? Water? Water? Water, water ocean? Uh, What's the name of the battle? <laughs> what did the British yes. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Can I get like some more gestures? Or... <laughs> <laughs> uh, what what's the French food? Um, <laughs> Can you help them out? How about Paul? Uh, right. right. <laughs> They were fighting over baguettes, weren't they? That's what it was. We all know a little more about the Battle of Waterloo now. <laughs> <laughs> it was over a baguette. It was over a baguette. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was that Napoleon guy. Yeah, no, no, it's baguette. <laughs> Those are good. Baguettes are good. All right, anyways. All right, we're going to do another tool chest. <laughs> yeah, that's what they're called. <laughs> we got and it. I need someone to interview. Who wants to... Oh yeah, you tie dye. Yeah. Hello, sir. What's your name? Hi, Jeremy. Hello, Jeremy. I'm Rachel. Hi, nice to meet you. Have a seat. Okay. So I've never met you before. Right. Why? <laughs> so uh, tell tell me a little about yourself. Well, I am the junior here at Purdue and going for English education. English ed. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want a job? <laughs> <laughs> Not in Indiana. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Nothing. Okay. <laughs> and yeah, it's so about what do you do for fun? Uh, I work at the Mini Mart in Tarkington. Uh, that the Tark Mart. That's like fun. Yeah. That's a yeah. lot of fun. Isn't Seven ninety wage. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> Why do you just tell me your wage? Are you trying to brag? <laughs> you don't think I make seven ninety an hour? What is this? I don't know. Can we go on to another question? <laughs> <laughs> Hey Jason. Hi. <laughs> my name's Tim. Nice to meet you, Tim. Thank uh, you. My name's Jeremy. Okay. <clears throat> Whatever you say. So, what is your favorite thing to do on campus here? Uh, come to stuff like this, you know, <laughs> and work at the Tark Mart where I make seven ninety. <laughs> your favorite thing is work at the Tark Mart. Where What's your favorite thing to do at the Tark Mart? Uh, like put the drinks away and stuff, and like organize like the drink room and stuff. I want to hang out with you. <laughs> What's your favorite thing to do when you're not working? Um, so people have hobbies. Um, yeah. <laughs> Here, I got this. Here. Right, right. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, what's up? <laughs> so Jeffrey. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I like your glasses. Thanks. Tom, right? Yep. Cool. That's about it. <laughs> Thank you so much, All Jeremy. Right. <laughs> Yourself from the <laughs> Do you want to use these? Yeah, we should use those. Freeze! <laughs> we're going to pass these out. <laughs> these give you guys control of what we're doing up here. And there's three of them. One's called Inner Monologue, one's called Show Me That, and one's called Oscorny Moment. We encourage you to pass these around to other people. And when you have it, shout it out, and we'll do what is on here. But only if you have these. Shout it out, hold it up. We'll do it. All right. Pass one here. Yes. I'm going to spin this, please. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Unfreeze.
Janice. What? I gotta tell you. What do you gotta tell me? I admire your form. You got great form. It's not a come on, I'm just saying. You like your form. <laughs> yeah, you hitting on me? Tell me that. <laughs> <laughs> What's your problem? I just wanted to say that you're stacking those cups wrong. How do you else do you use cups? It's supposed to go black to gold, not gold to black. How do I know? How are people gonna know which cups to buy? I'm a Inner monologue. <laughs> Hiring producers. It's the worst idea I ever had. I should hire Purdue graduates. Once they've learned some things. I'm only earning six thirty an hour. I got five hundred thousand dollars on the line here. I bought this store thinking I could make a buck. I'm just trying to stack cups. I don't know what you want from me. I want you to do your job, Janice. It's in your description. It says black to gold. <laughs> I just stack up gold to black. I demand a raise. <laughs> Janice. We've been seeing each other for a couple of months now. Yeah. And yeah. I was wondering if you wanted to. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty nervous. She's just so pretty and hot me, and I don't have that many hobbies. <laughs> I don't really know what she sees in me. I'm hoping she says yes. I was wondering if you'd like to go play canasta. Show me that. <laughs> Have you guys melded yet? It's 50 to meld. Oscar winning moment. <laughs> it's How hard is this? It's 50 to meld. It's groups of seven. You get a canasta when you have seven. Four of a kind, and then three wild cards is okay. That's a dirty canasta. Are you in? Have you melded it? Melt! Melt! I'm all in! There's no all in a canasta! <laughs> Well, we, we don't know until we try. So just one game of canasta. <laughs> I have this friend. One game of canasta. <laughs> hey, is your girlfriend coming back over? I don't know. That was intense. Yeah, uh, it was fun. I liked it. <laughs> yeah, that was the best game of canasta I've ever played. <laughs> you guys really knew what you were doing, Eddie. Yeah. Normally when I play, it's like I have to explain every rule. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> okay, so just teach me before I ask her. Well, so first it's 50 to meld. You need 50 points to meld. I'm all in. No, no, no. Take it back. <laughs> Eight and above is five, 10 points. Below that is five points. Black threes are garbage cards, but red threes are worth 100 points each. You know, I'll back. It's like, it's like people are the dumbest about Knesset, you know what I'm right. saying? <laughs> But that was really fun. Like you guys were like popping, bam, bam, bam. I haven't crazy. talked to her in a couple of weeks. <laughs> yeah, that's a shame. Yeah. That's a shame. So I think next time maybe we should play a less intense game. Oh, hey, Janice. It's Janice. Hey, Janice. <laughs> How you doing? I'm good. I'm okay. Inner monologue, Janice. <laughs> <laughs> So, so we've we been, been friends for a really long time. People always confuse us. <laughs> I'm not doing so good. No, tell me. I'm stacking the cups wrong. My oh. man just down. Honey. Getting on my back. I, I can't take it. I can't. Show me that. <laughs> Black to gold! <laughs> what is so hard about that? <laughs> Get it! <laughs> <laughs> Yes.
Josh at work all the time. Is his name Josh? Oscar, what are you doing? So weird. <laughs> we know the same person. <laughs> That's so freaky. <laughs> <laughs> what are we gonna do with this knowledge? What's, what's going? Put your hands in the air! Inner monologue! I really don't want to do this. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just in a really weird place in my life. And I just feel like if I just kind of force them to be my friends. <laughs> Like, I don't know, get a drink or play canesta or something. Got, I'm really good at canesta. You got Tell me that. You should <laughs> Bam! No. I win! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. So, what will you be a thing? It was at the cops! <laughs> the cops! Yes, it was the ops! <laughs> So, honey, did you make any friends today? <laughs> I just... You've always been alone. I know. And I just... I try so hard. But we, they just... They never want to play custom with me. We have so many dirty dishes. <laughs> I'm really sorry. <laughs> We're just the two of us, and I wish there were more people. Mm -hmm. so it would make I, sense! It would make sense! I use all the dishes and pretend we have friends. <laughs> Isn't it good? <laughs> My mom made it. <laughs> now, which one of you did that? <laughs> Go back. <laughs> I really wish I was less emotionally damaged so I could help you wash all those dishes. <laughs> Never since your father died. I had a father. <laughs> Everybody has a father. You have to have one. Why? In a monologue. This is all so new to me. I have a father. Show me that. <laughs> I never want to do that again. <laughs> so soon. Go back. <laughs> you had a father. He died in childhood. <laughs> <laughs> There's Gammy and Gamps. And Why didn't Gamps die in childbirth? <laughs> you get stronger constitution. I Show think. me that. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing. I got this. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Woo! Take it out! Josh, I got her to agree to one more date. Good. You can contain yourself. This is D and D. D and D. No. D day. Yeah. No. D. <laughs> D and D. In. D and D. Is the Dean coming over? It's fine. You'll do fine. Just tone it down. Oscar, I know it. Tone it down. Tone what down? <laughs> Total <Total town. laughs> You're hurting me. I just never realized that I was so destructive in my personality. I thought we were just hanging out and having friends, having friends over, but it turns out that I'm a monster. Show me that. 
Spend some time alone. I'm gonna think about it. In a monologue. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> you got a half hour. She'll be here. <coughs> got it. <coughs> alone time. <laughs> okay. Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> She's here, buddy. Janice says. <laughs> Hi, my oh, that's great. I, she wants to play Dungeons and Dingies too. D and D, come on in. D and D, yeah. Josh, come on. So she and I will take the chair. It's only right. I'm so sorry, Josh. It's usually not like this. I have no idea. Josh, what? Ready. Come on. You said half an hour. I, 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 I need the extra 20 you minutes. You can do this. I'll be out in 20 minutes. I need the time. Come on. Can yeah. we roll dice? I'm sorry I'm not dressed, ladies. I thought I had more time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um. Hey, we can wait to start. It's okay. No, now. <laughs> Would you please get Janice a cup? I got the cup! I got the cup! <laughs> Do you guys know each other? No. Is anybody gonna pick the table up? <laughs> All right, okay. That was a pretty weird request, Janus. <laughs> to put it down? I just, I, she, she ran right over it. All right, so, the way Canasta works. Wait, Canasta, I thought we said D&D. Canasta! That's what we're playing. Uh, but I forgot my right. inhaler! Alright, everybody take the required amount of cards. <laughs> you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> I will kill all of you in Canasta. See! All right, we are going to play. Uh, you think that works? Sure. We're going to play a quick game of good, bad, worst advice. So, can I get Katie, Matt, and Tim up here? <laughs> Okay. All right. So, do you have any? Uh, I don't which, know. Which, which ones are we? Yeah. Oh, your good, bad, worst. Good advice. Wait. We're giving you advice. On your problems. I was gonna get to that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Does anybody have any questions that they want to ask our panel of experts here? STDs. Uh, you in the back. <laughs> My child keeps yelling, STDs, STDs. <laughs> <laughs> I can't leave the house. I'm afraid they're listening to my private conversations. How can I protect myself? Katie. Well, I think first maybe you should see a doctor. Maybe your child has Tourette's. Have they been talking to you too? <laughs> it, it's... I'm not sure who your child is, but I would go get them checked out to see if they have Tourette's, and then, you know, if that doesn't work, maybe invest in some soundproof walls. <laughs> uh, I think you should go see a doctor if you're having <laughs> these problems, because those can get out of hand. It's good to get checked. Huh. I don't think you should just give your kid an STD. <laughs> <laughs> New question! Tie-dye shirt. Hi. I need some hobbies. You need some what? Hobbies. Hobbies. So uh, there are plenty of clubs to choose from at Purdue. You can go on to what eboard, I believe it is, and you can try to check some groups out. Get involved. You know, get involved. That's so what it's called now. Yeah. It's been a while, but yeah, find some hobbies. Get some friends. Okay. <laughs> I think you should just kind of walk around until 
inspiration comes to you. You know, just walk around and you know, maybe you'll see a bird and you'll feel like being a bird. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, there's this place called Tark Mart and I believe <laughs> <laughs> Tell me more. <laughs> Burn. Do we have any other questions? Yes, yeah, you in the back. I will watch Breaking Bad when it's on, but the campus TV doesn't have AMC. Oh, what? Oh. What do you suggest? Uh, maybe find a friend who's off campus who has a satellite or a cable, and maybe you can watch it then. Have your friends dress up as the characters from Breaking Bad, <laughs> and they can stand in front of the TV and act it up for you. Have us dress up as the characters from Breaking Bad and stand in front of your TV and act out the episode for you. There you go. Problem solved. Uh, yes, see you. So sorry. You should definitely approach her about it. Make sure that you have your information correct. And if she did, unfortunately, it might be best to move on. Uh, you should cheat uh, back. <laughs> Get some revenge. All right, stay with me. Break up with your girlfriend. Date the guy she cheated on you with, but then cheat on him with her. Thank you. Okay, we're going to play one last game for y'all. All right, everybody up in the line. We're going to tell you guys a story. We like to do that. So we're basically competing for your love and attention. So each of us has a story. And we're each going to um, tell it. Tell it. <laughs> we're going to stand up here and tell it. And then I'm talking. And then one of my other teammates can interrupt me and say something like Objection. Uh, that's a terrible story. <laughs> so if you agree with him, you clap. If you disagree with him, boo. <laughs> and then I get to stay up here if you boo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last person standing up there, three minutes, wins. And can I get a suggestion for um, um, something you're doing this weekend? Notre Dame game. Football. Football game. Okay, okay. Football. Ready, go. Okay, so I hate football. Ever since I was five years old. So I love football, and I'm going to it How many of you guys are going to go to the game tomorrow? Yeah. No. So I'm afraid we're probably going to lose. Objection. We're going to never lose. Yeah. When I was a freshman here at Purdue, I had a season tickets to the football games, and I went twice. Objection. That's a waste of money. Yeah. American football, but I watch English football, and it's pretty cool. Yeah. 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 So it's called football. Um, I'm really getting objection, into pretentious. Yeah. Yeah. So I like the gridiron, the American football. Yeah. My favorite professional team is the Chicago Bears. And yeah. So, go back. <laughs> I think we stand a chance. Yes. 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 We never stand a chance. Woo! So anyway, I never, I went twice to two Purdue football games. And I didn't even Objection. sell it. Obviously, you went to two Purdue football games if you went twice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I don't watch a lot of football, but I played powder puff football when I was in high school, and I got to be the running Objection, back. Objection, not real football. Awesome. <laughs> I forgot how to play the game, but I remember how to play powder puff football, and it was awesome, and I was the running back, and I totally scored. The only thing I was disappointed in is that we weren't allowed to tackle. Objection. <laughs> Everything in football is disappointing. <laughs> okay, so when I was five years old, my parents dragged me to this terrible football party, and I was, I was just staring at the TV. I was like, what the heck is going on? Why is it taking them five minutes to run a 30-second play? Like Objection. It's pretty obvious why it takes... <laughs> 
so after the second game, I decided not to go anymore. Not because it was like expensive, because I had the tickets already, but because it was like noon games. It was really hot, and I was a freshman, and I didn't know any better. Objection! You're whining. Tell. So um, I ended up just not even giving the tickets to anybody. I just kind of put them in my pocket. That's a waste. Yeah. You are wasteful. So um, when I was in England, I really wanted to go and visit Manchester because uh, they have a really good team, Manchester United. Yeah. Yeah. Objection. Talk about England some more. Yeah. 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 So back here in America at Purdue. I spent the remainder of my Saturdays freshman year playing Doom 3. You win! Yes! Yeah. Doom 3 wins it! Doom 3! What year was that? Like, Shut up, Sammy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we have been Ad Liberation with Katie, Sammy, Matt, Tim, and I'm Rachel. Thank you so much!